you don't believe in it you are also followed and persecuted for that so it is completely normal that somebody who leaves this bond whose entire life was defined by the fears of no uh, we, we have a friend here who's more on our i feel like he's way more it's not about Muhammad Hijab. Down, no, it's not down, about him. Calm down. It's not about that. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Don't be scared. 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 Don't What's the definition of utilitarianism? What's the definition of utilitarianism? I can't have a utilitarian point of view. What is the definition of utilitarianism? I'm asking you a basic question, man. What's the definition of utilitarianism? Still, by definition, genocide, but at least it is not death. So that, that is what you are agreeing with. Genocide. Well, this is by definition of genocide. Conceivable that apostates, no matter what kind of apostates they are, should right. be, should be I haven't accepted. used the word inconceivable because inconceivable means not possible, right? The sky is only an appearance, only something that we have that we see. No, but the sky in the Arabic language, sorry, can I just correct you on something here? The sky in the Arabic, if you look at the Arabic. Do you understand philosophy at all? Yeah, I do, and I've got the degrees to show it. Have you, do you, have you got anything to show it? Because that would imply <laughs> you are a <laughs> you're an individual. I, I have no muscles here. I have no muscles. I I have no muscles here. I have no muscles. I I have no muscles. Please try and find. Oh, oh, you would have found it many contradictions. So there's many of them. Challenge there to try and find contradictions in the Quran. I have falsified the Quran. Fine. Fine. Do it now. That's fine. The inimitability challenge is to try and produce something like the Quran, which means that it has to go within the scope of. On, bro, a year 10, year 11 in ethics can get a better understanding of you. I'm saying a 16 year old, a sharp 16 year old will see that you don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. That has to be subjective. No, it's not. They're going to get laughed at. You know, cosmic skeptics, them guys, they're going to laugh at you, bro. They're going to associate with this idiot. With all due respect, you have not in any level understanding of morality. You don't even have a basic understanding of moral philosophy. You don't. So, and you can't pretend you have to To the Muslim viewers who don't uh, understand philosophy very well. Oh, well, you okay. don't know it. You have no. <laughs> you don't know it. Saying, you don't oh, believe in, like, don't know, which you've said. You said you don't believe in objective morality. If you don't believe in objective morality, which means this means. Any, this, this, you know what the implication is? The implication is this. The implication is any argument you get, make against Islam, which is moral, if you're asking about. Uh, age of consent or apostasy or penal laws or anything you want to ask from this day onwards you have no right that, that it means that this will be a law that society has agreed on and this is utilitarianism no so it's not really, that's not that's not a definition of utilitarianism utilitarianism is not defined like that by any moral or political philosopher by the way just and i've written essays on utilitarianism really i've written by the way i've got some of something written on utilitarianism as well it's called the problem of liberalism and you can find that on for, for free. Mohammed Hajar put it on Google. Uh, liberalism, good. liberalism, and you can find it for free. I've written about the stuff you claim to talk about. I've written about it, bro. To me, you're not a professor. You're not my senior. You just, if you're my senior at, at, at this point, at not, this point, I feel like it puts you to just go and yeah. uh, read Mohammed Hajab's books because yeah. you seem like you're very lost. They're very misunderstood yeah. with Islam. So I, I, I recommend you to go. Please, just allow me, just for a second, yeah. You yeah. tell me, give me a second. Give me a second. Let me just get, get educate, let me educate you. Let me share my knowledge with you. Innit? What's wrong? You educate me from your little no knowledge from your Google search. Let me educate you. <laughs> knowledge. Let me tell you what's going on. Utilitarianism. Yeah. <laughs> in that book, he said in on utilitarianism is the name of the book. On chapter four, yeah, he he talked about proving utilitarianism. Now he didn't mention he didn't name it like that. He named it a long uh, thing as Cosmic Skeptics told me in the debate. But anyway, he took like a, a long um, title, but it's candid in there. He talks about desirability, yeah? He doesn't in any way, shape or form try and say that utilitarianism is in any way. In a so in other words, if you're, you, if you're pegging your moral value judgments on utilitarianism, 
You can't go and attack the Quran because you know why? You don't have an anchorage. You don't have an objective morality. Therefore, if you want to make a moral argument against Islam and say, well, Islam is against this and therefore Islam is wrong, it's a false argument. If you're basing it on utilitarian, if that's your seedbed, if that's your intellectual and epistemological seedbed, it's not going to work. We have destroyed and my we have destroyed everything. I was at, at this point you just sound you just sound really childish and you sound like you have an IQ of 39. A plus A plus defend your religion. A plus you've tried your best. Yeah, remove him. Remove him. Remove him. Uh, a plus it was good having you. Thank you for I think at this point you for nothing. you're not up to Muhammad Hijab's level. You got nothing. You did not you nothing. You finished now by the atheist. And you finished? You're alive and you're finished. Hello, no, and you're finished. And you're finished. And you're finished. May, may, may no, uh, you go read the books of Muhammad Hijab and, and your wife. You know, see guidance. You gotta be kidding me. You have, you have three certificates, right? No, four, actually. I, I, could, I, could currently, I could pay $4,000 to get a certificate in Islamic State. I'd like to go way back now.